today we'll try to see how transpiration occurs in plants and also we'll try to see by the end of the experiment how water along with the nutrients moves up through the stem into the branches and into the leaves for this the thing that we'll be needing are two celery sticks two glasses filled with water two different food colorings and a knife so first we'll cut the edges of the celery sticks so that they get smooth from the bottom next we add red color to one of the glasses red food color and green food color to the other glass now we dip one of the celery sticks in the red water and the other one in green water i am just wiping this away so that when the effect comes it's very easily visible to us i am dipping this celery stick which is absolutely neat and clean let me chop it a bit more because it's not very neat from the bottom and here i dip it in the green glass i leave the plants to stand in the glasses and i'll come back and observe it after half an hour we continue to observe the plant at periodic intervals and saw significant changes in it everyone so now we are observing the same plant that we had planted in the water in the in the colored water yesterday after around 18 hours one of the plants which was which had been dipped in the green glass uh did not show uh the xylem effect as it was dead so it shriveled up quickly however this plant stood tall and it was bent yesterday but as the water started flowing through it upwards it started gaining height and is now standing tall after 18 hours another change that we notice in this plant is that the leaves the edges of the leaves are now turning red you can see the nodes the edges of the leaves are now turning giving that red tinge and that is what we're going to try to show you that this is because of the xylem effect of the plant because of the xylem vessels the red water is traveling up through the stem into the leaves and we'll now show you how these vessels are running on top of this plant for this i'll now remove the plant from the glass to make the effect better and more clear i'm just going to dab it with a tissue paper so that all the extra color goes away and now very slowly i am going to cut a cross section of this plant very carefully and going to open it up so as you can very clearly see it's beautiful you can see how the veins of the plant have turned red and this is exactly what is happening these veins are carrying water on top of the plant let me open it further you see this is a red vein which is traveling up and up these are the xylem vessels which carry water let me show you one more in fact you can even see the xylem which is present on this let me cut one more portion of this and let me open it wide apart here you see how the red vessels are traveling up can you see it as compared to this
let me show you a healthy plant another plant which has not been dipped in any color and let me show you a cross section of that let me take another one you see here there is no color as compared to this this plant which was dipped in a red coloring very clearly shows us how xylem is carrying the red water up to the leaves all the way up to the leaves all right so i'm sure you've enjoyed this this proves that xylem carries water and minerals up from the stem to the leaf of the plant and this finally moves out through the leaves through the process of transpiration this plant this water is then lost out of the leaves through the small pores right thank you